Everyone faces inner battles. Yep, even me. So how do you overcome them? It's not easy, but it's possible. For me, now I choose not to face them alone. Growing up though, this wasn't always the case. As a child, I couldn't speak to my parents. I didn't know my daddy personally. My mama was young when she had me and she left me with a lady named Gertrude at the age of four. I love Gertrude though, man. She was a no-nonsense Bible-based believer and she raised me in a strict Baptist household. <laughs> yeah, she taught me how to respect people and respect myself. And that's something I will never, ever forget. Thank you, Gertrude. But listen, as a teen dealing with my feelings of abandonment from my parents and watching my sister battle with drug addiction and, and in and out of prison, man, and not wanting to come off as a soft kid to my friends, it led me to act out. And then at 15, I saw a friend of mine get shot and killed in an accidental shooting. And before then, I didn't think I could die so young. It was then I knew I had to make a change. I started going back to church and my gospel career started to form and take off. Man, and on my journey, I met my wife, my girl, Tammy Franklin, whom I met as a child and we became close friends later in life. Uh, she was with me when my career took off very quickly. I love that girl. I went from performing in churches in Texas to opening up for your boy Steve Harvey, touring worldwide and selling millions and millions of albums. Even then, we went through some tough battles together and individually, but we went to counseling to get through them all. 30 plus years after starting my gospel career and going through the ups and downs, you know how it is, of just even being in the public eye, I am thankful that I'm still here. I have a loving wife, four grown beautiful children, and I've built a legacy that I hope God would be proud of. I am so grateful for all that he's done for me. Even with all that, even all I've done in my career, y'all, I still get stressed, believe it or not, where the song doesn't you know, happen the way I wanted it to, and, and it doesn't go as planned, and I battle with self-doubt, anxiety, and loneliness. But I need for you to know you're not alone. You are not alone. I've been there too, and I'm successful today because I learned not to face my issues in isolation. Here's what I want you to do. I want you to trust in God, put your faith in God, and stay close to the Father. Keep people around you that will help you get through your pain. Yes, and when any unhealthy, self-defeating thoughts come your way, my accountability partners remind me, and I'm reminding you, to let go and let God. I am winning the battles that I fight within myself, and you can too. No matter what you are going through, you have endured, and you can win.